Hey guys, this is Dragon Roll, and welcome back to To The Moon. So, I actually don't know where we are. So let's go ahead and explore. Heh, <laughs> look what we have here. Okay, okay, now I know. So this was right before the house was being built. Yep. I bet they saw this cliff and thought it was not dangerous enough without people living on it. So I actually got some bad news for you guys. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to get the webcam to work just yet. So, but don't worry, I'm on it. I'm gonna get that. I'm hoping I'm gonna get that up and running by. I hope Friday, maybe. There's just a lot of things going on with it. Nick called and said I should come. I brought you pickled olives. They're your favorite, right? I heard about River. Will she be okay? Her illness was just diagnosed in its late stage. Fortunately, it's treatable. But the medical bills... We can't afford to finish building this house, Isabel. We can barely afford to pay for her treatment. I'm just relieved that she'll be okay, but... You don't know how much this place means to her. She's going to be heartbroken. I'd help, but Ted and I have been barely getting by since the market crashed. What are you going to do now? Um, I'm going to tell her that we can make it. I'm going to tell her that we can afford everything. I don't want to do anything crazy. You shouldn't lie to her. You don't understand, Isabel. If she found out, I'm not sure which she'd choose. So what? If she chooses not to save herself for the sake of this place, then so be it. It's what she really wants. I really dislike when you neurotypicals think you know what's best for others. I hate when you call me that, Izzy. Do you think this is all about her? What about me, Isabel? After all these years, am I not allowed to be selfish even once? I don't want to be alone, Isabel. I'm not going to let her die. That's arrogant. I don't care. Where are you going? I'm going to pick something from this cliff and to bring back to her. At least give her some comfort. That doesn't make what you're doing any less wrong. Nick wanted me to give you this. Oh, it's a music box. He said it's called Everything's Alright. It isn't. Anything back up this way? Whoa, two. Okay, I guess I can't go that way anymore. Okay, so that's my memento. Anything in the house? One more memento.
Okay. Let's prepare the memento. Alright, let's see what we got here. It's pickled olives, and the ideal is three. Oh, sweet Jesus. How do I do this? Ha-ha! There we go. Nope. Pickled olives. Activate the memento. Yes, we are. So you guys are really going for it, huh? Yep, the construction's starting in just a few months. It's a bit of a squeeze, we had to split the payment. But with financing, we'll make do. How wonderful, having your dream house built at such a beautiful site. You had your wedding at that lighthouse near there all those years ago, didn't you? That's not all that special about it. We have a long history with that place. Well, it's good to have some good news at a get-together for once. Cheers and congratulations, you two. Hey, cheers. Be right back. I'm gonna get some fresh air. Me too. Well, buddy, it's sure been a while. Hasn't it? Who knew how hard it is to get across a few cities nowadays? That river, still so quiet, huh? Eh, she's actually been talkative at home, and with Isabel. I guess she's just not used to you. Haha, <laughs> so I'm the bad guy here, huh? Oh, hey. So did you tell River that thing from back then? The music kind of changed. I did. So how'd she take it? For the most part, she took it well. But something bugs me. Ever since the incident, she's been making these strange rabbits out of paper. Origami rabbits? Yes, lots of them. Ha! I used to fold the origami animals for my daughter all the time. What's wrong with that? I don't think it's the same thing. She's been doing nothing but making the same rabbits day in and day out. Our house is literally filled with them now. Didn't Isabel say that something like that is a common trait with River's condition? Yes, but something doesn't feel right this time. When I ask her about it, she never answers. Instead, she gets this distant look in her eyes. It's almost as like she wants something from me. The strange thing is... I feel like there's something I owe her, too. Have you asked Isabel? Yes. She said she talked to her about it, but she got nothing. Well, I'm certainly not one to inquire, but I'll tell you this. I've known you since middle school, and you're notorious for overthinking. You're probably just imagining things. There's no need to get too worked up. Usually when someone says that, Something's always wrong. But I'll give you the benefit of doubt. You're probably right. Probably? I'm always right, John. Wait, so even he himself never knew what was up with those rabbits? Forget about those stupid rabbits. We got bigger problems. It's a confined memory, and there are no mementos anywhere. Don't worry, we could probably draw one out from him. How? Leave it to me. I just gotta give the bartender a quick visit first.
Hey there, could I get you anything? Hey oh, could I get a bottle of pickled olives, please? Sure, cash your credit. Check. Er, I'm sorry, we don't take checks. Oh, just put it on my tab then. Wait, does that mean you don't have any money? You're so getting resetted. Hey there, could I get you anything? <laughs> can I get a bottle of pickle olives, please? Sure, cash your credit. Just put it on my tab. I feel like spending big today. Okay, thank you, sir. Here are your pickled olives. Thanks, bro. You'll be getting an enormous amount of tips today. Thank you, sir. You're such an ass, Neil. I'll loosen up. Alright, so after kind of cheating out the pickled olives in the memory... Let's see if we can draw some mementos out. Why, is that bottle of pickled olives you're sporting? Yeah, are you a fellow olive lover? Indeed I am! Just got a fresh bottle of them myself, in fact. Alright, we have two. Mind if I join you? Sure, why don't you grab a seat? We'll down a bottle together. Oh. Yeah, that just... That sounds just swell. Eva! Disable taste simulation now! Oh, Neil. I don't think I feel like it. I'm so gonna get you back for this. So that's how we got our first toaster. Oh ho ho ho! Ah! 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 You okay there? Yes, I'm just... Savoring the amazingness of pickled olives. They're wonderful, aren't they? Yeah, I just can't understand how anyone could. Ugh, find such things to be disgusting. Take your time. We got two bottles left. Oh, poor Watts. So I said, hey, that's not right. They totally agreed. Oh, no. <laughs> you know what else is wrong with the society today? Yeah, I actually have it right here. Why? May I see it? Eh, okay. Here it is. And freeze! Finally, dear lord! How are the elves, Neil? Oh, shut your mouth. That must have been great. Memento detected! Wait, don't you dare. Don't worry, sheesh. See, I'm doing it by the books. Hulk smash! Neil, seriously. I'm trying to get into this and you're ruining the mood. Totally worth it. Let's go ahead and jump right in! What puzzle is... Oh, it's the paper. Of uh, current ideal for... Um... Hmm. Huh. So, boom, 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 boom. Yeah, I'm smart. Let's jump back even further. And see what's going up between these two. By that I mean River and John. Yay, them in their younger years. Well, it's all boarded up now. Cracky nutcrackers! You aren't Australian. Who cares? We're like 20 billion nanometers off the ground and standing on a damn flagpole. Just jump down. It's not like you could be hurt here. Are you kidding me? It's a freaking skydive. You can't stay on here. You can't get off. God, I hate it when this happens. I swear if this place... Ava! What the fuck? What's...
I wouldn't want to jump down that either. Mm mm. Why would they abandon her like this? I suppose she's just no longer needed. No longer needed? By ships, I mean. You know how it is now that everything has GPS and all that. Look, River. This place means a lot to me, too. And I've been thinking. In our current state, things have been pretty stable. If we save well and if we use, we can afford to build a house on top of here. It's going to be a squeeze, but I'm sure we'd be able to see her from the window. In the morning, at night, we'd always be nearby. And, and we can walk here anytime. She'll never be alone again, John. I'll be able to watch over here every day. Yeah, we will. Good for them. You gotta be kidding me. You remember what happens, don't you? It's like watching a train wreck. The ending isn't any more important than any of the memories leading to it. The important thing is that over the, there, they are happy. Let's move on. Aww. Alright. God, I love the music. Wait a minute. They were referring to the lighthouse as Anya, weren't they? I suppose so. Then that river, she declined treatment for the sake of a lighthouse. Isn't that a bit too extreme? I've seen stranger things in the course of this job. Me too, but ugh, I can never wrap my head around it. It's none of our business anyway. She's not our client. Receive note, Anya. Let's go ahead and take a look at the notes. Anya, the abandoned lighthouse by the cliffside. Uh, a song Johnny wrote for his deceased wife. Its title is a placeholder. Pickle Doll is Johnny's favorite. Okay. Uh, where do I go from here? Oh. Okay. So, where are the other mementos? I guess down here? The f oh. oh, there's just a random paper rabbit out here. Memento detected. No comment about a random paper or just random origami out here. By the road. Okay. Prepare. Was that, was that say step twice in the step tweak in the river? What? Oh well. All right. So ideal is five. Okay, I messed up. No, I didn't! Oh my god! I'm so good at this. Okay. I know I messed up the first puzzle, but A. I'm learning. Activate. River? Still in his midlife. Yellow paper rabbit. Dear Lord, not again. Any books? Any books? Nope.
No, I didn't want to go back upstairs. I uh, gotta be careful around the stairs. An old baby grand piano. How the heck did they move this thing upstairs? Who knows, but I bet be a piece of cake for the TARDIS. Not really, you can't even get it through its door. Hmm, true. Well, that sells it. Moving pianos is a pain in the arse for everybody. It'd probably take an entire episode to get inside. I wouldn't mind seeing such an episode. Me neither. It sounds pretty epic. Doctor Who! New boxes of plain paper. Uh-oh. I know where this is going. Ooh, I hope you don't hear that. There's a storm going on outside. You went out for a haircut this early in the morning? What are you making there? Rabbits. Did you see the rabbit out of free? Yeah. Tell me about that rabbit. Huh? Describe the rabbit. Erm, um, it was yellow. What else? A bit puffy? And? Well, it's just a paper rabbit. I don't know how else to describe it. Strange river. Is something wrong? River? Uh oh. I don't know about you, but I'm getting some inverse deja vu. I think I know of her condition, but this is rather odd even for that. You think she's. Do you? Perhaps, who knows. But like you said, she's not our client. Let's just get what we're paid for over with. Um, can you guys explain to me what, what you're saying? Like, even after seeing a plate through this, I still don't know. Or if anyone else that's watching this, if you know what they're talking about. Like, I already know what happens, but... If you guys know, if you can send me, like, a message or something, I don't want to leave any spoilers in the comments. Many long strands of orange hair. So this is the day she started it, huh? Hey! Two, three, four, five! And we are good to go! Ideal three. Activate the momentum? Yes. God. I can hear the rain from inside here. Practically listen to listen to this song with uh, rainy mood. 
it's rather amazing actually. I got a memento from nothing? Or just the steps of going up to the lighthouse? What's going on here? Um... Nope, nothing over here. Oh boy. Let's see. Da, 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 da. Da, da. I always try to look for everything possible. Hidden nooks and crannies. This is where the house used to be, isn't it? The house that never should have been. I mean, really. What is it about unusually high and dangerous places that attract people? No, acrophobia. Fear of heights. I believe. Please let me be smart. Something that Johnny River apparently didn't have. Yeah. Afraid of pipes. Oh no, I'm kept by flowers! Oh, I think we got some. Hey, the lighthouse is working. Is that why you approached me back then? Yeah. What about now? I suppose it's just part of it. Look, it was a long time ago. It's not too relevant now, but Izzy and I should tell you the truth. I shouldn't have tainted our first meeting like that. What is that? A hacky sack? Oh no. Can you throw this as far as where Anya's at? I don't know. You want me to try? Would you? Oh no, 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 no. Oh no. River! Are you insane? Get away from there! I think this memory isn't too far from the last. Think they make me connected? Probably. Uh, Why'd she cut her hair anyway? I like long hair. Alright, time to find the memento. Uno momento. God damn bushes and flowers. Oh no, this is where I was. Where's the memento then? Where's the memento? Oh, probably maybe. What the f- Am I allowed to do this? <laughs> Am I allowed to just roll off? Oh no. Okay, there we go. Okay, right now I have no idea what's going on, but I can just literally walk through anything and anywhere. <laughs> what is this? Did I accidentally break the game? Let's go to the moon! <laughs> Hey. Well, I went to the moon. I think I'm done. Fair the memento. Four. That was easy enough. Patch 
attached a backpack. Okay, I can still go out into the middle of nowhere. Moving right along. Almost there. Everyone with it is different, John. Just because she and I share this syndrome doesn't mean we share the same head. But you must be able to help somehow. Everything was okay at first, but now she's m even more aloof than before. Even when we're in the same room, she's never really there. It's starting to take a toll on me. I just don't know how to take it anymore. Well, I can't speak for her, but many of us do long for connections. Though, being able to articulate it is a different story. Just because she struggles to express it, it doesn't mean she doesn't feel anything. She's still there, right? Sometimes you just have to have faith that she cares. That's pretty difficult to do day in and day out. I know. Wait, but why do you seem so normal, Izzy? I mean, don't you have the same condition? For one, I was diagnosed when I was still young. With effort, it's not impossible to acquire guys with social norms systematically. But you know what? I'm both Envy and Pity River. Me? I'm an actress because I've been doing it all my life. Not only on stage, but off stage. And at practically every moment. I've gotten good at it because acting is the only option I have. It's the only way for me to be normal. But River, she never did that. She remained an outcast and refused to learn to step against it. I don't know if it was by choice or by limit, whether bravery or cowardice. There are days when I just can't stand faking it anymore. And then, I realize that it's too late. The Isabel that people know of is all an act, and the real me has been long become a stranger. I think in the end, I just envy her. Huh, I've never met a woman with it before. Then technically, you still haven't met one. This isn't part of our business, let's move on. Hey, Johnny's coming down. Anything new today? No. What are you rereading re there? The Emperor's new clothes. I loved this when I was young. Still do, huh? Of course. Just for different reasons. When I was a kid, I loved the Animal series. I know. Mother gave you a book from it as a wedding present. Heh, <laughs> yeah. That was one odd wedding present. I guess I was pretty obsessed with it when I was a kid. Why haven't you read them since? Uh oh. Hmm? I saw them. They're collecting dust in the garage. Well, I just grew out of them, I guess. I mean, they're children's books. What's wrong with reading children's books? They're comforting. I suppose so. I think I'm going to get this one. Hey! There's lots of Johns. I'm not yours, you're not mine. Be my Auntie Valentine. Hey River, this one's not that corny. River? Uh oh. Uh 
okay. But what about David? He's my favorite character. Uh, I don't know. What are you talking about? Animorphs, have you read it? No. Yes. Really? Sort of. Oh, oh, do you know what animal is David's main morph? Um... That doesn't sound right. Don't worry, I'll find out for you. What was it? Tobias Hawk, Rachel Grizzly, Jake Tiger, Marco Gorilla, David Cobra, Cassie Wolf. Why? Cobra Snake, god, oh my. I was just wondering. Could have just Googled it. True. But I'm in the middle of a game. Cobra! What is. Oh yeah, Cobra! I really wish they kept the old covers instead of these plane sheets. They were cool. What now? The world would be easier on the eyes if people just remembered faces more. Memento detected. One at a time. Memento, prepare. Ideal is five, current zero. What does I do? Oh, no, 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 I'm... Ah, oh, I messed up. Oh, I messed up big time. Oh, well. Can't get them all. Receive note. Animorphs. Activate memento. Activate. The mystery just keeps getting deeper. As soon as we think we get an answer, we just get more questions. And what is all this? Oh, I think it's the wedding? Oh, everyone's leaving already, but I just got here. Seems to happen to you a lot at parties. Oh, go save your childish jabs for the insecure. Pickled olives. Or an age animal's book. A glass of bottle of pickled olives. I see you live from Mars, but where's the moose? That's the corniest remark you've made all night. Don't you mean, cheesiest remark? Wow. Uh... Okay, visible people are blocking me. I guess I go up. Yeah, I think this is the wedding. Yep, right up here. Oop. There they are. Yep, young adulthood. Nothing? Really? Okay, here we go. Do you feel any different? 
Now that we got the rings on, I mean. No. Why? Do you? Actually, yeah, I think so. What is it like? It's just different. Oh, she's got a blue and yellow dress on. Oh, no. Oh, my. Just responsibilities, I suppose. Responsibilities. Do you like the name Anya? Would you like to name her Anya? Would you? I understand. Yeah. Anya is a good name for her. Hey, come with me. In the moonlight. This can't be a good idea. I'll probably trip and fall. Don't worry, just follow my steps. <laughs> Ow, my ass! I think you stepped on my toes. Sorry. Come on, let's try again. Dance until morning. No, no, this is when they were being married. To promise to love and comfort, to honor, and to keep in sickness and in health for as long as you shall live. I do. And do you take this man standing before you to be your lawfully wedded husband? To promise to love and comfort, to honor and to keep in sickness and in health for as long as you shall live. Yes. By the power invested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you Mr. and Mrs. Wildhouse. Where were we this whole time? Ah, the wedding. Uh, yeah, what did you think that was? I'm just bad at weddings, that's all. Fluids tend to escape from my eyes. I didn't know you were that sentimental. Oh, did I say my eyes? I meant my mouth. By fluids, I meant both foods and solids. That's a lovely image. Thanks, Neil. Come, let's find a way to get out of here. All this happiness and joy is really putting you off, too, huh? Is that me, or is the music just too loud? No, I just don't like watching people make mistakes. Sheesh, whatever happened to just take it moment by moment? Ouch. I think that's all the mementos I can get from here. Oh, bushes. They will be the death of me. Oh, I'd better go see how your aunt is doing. Alright, Ma. Tell her thanks for coming. I will. I'm so proud of you, Joey. Joey? Oh, that's my grandpa's name. He passed away before I was born. Ma calls me by it as my nickname. How come you never told me about it? Because I'd rather you call me John. Ach, not another sentimental grandparent childhood. What do you have against those anyway? I mean, you should talk about your grandfather a lot. What? No, I don't. Whatever you say. Nope, Joey.
Let's check out. There we go. Johnny's nickname, named after his grandfather. So, one more memento. Where can I get that from? I'm so proud of Joey. I guess. Um, hmm. Down here, maybe? Nope. Bushes and flowers. My eternal nemesis in this game. Bushes and flowers. Hey! Cars! Cars galore! Oh no! It can't be helped, River. I'm sure they didn't mean to. Come on, what lady? Wait, is that a rabbit? Think this is the source of all those folded paper ones? Why would she obsess over some roadkill? That's been so many years later. Don't ask me. You are the woman here. I'll be convinced that I'm the only one when you do a cordless bungee jump. Ooh, calling you out. Hey, dead rabbit. Three, four, five. Prepare. Let's see what's up. Oh. That's great. Activate the memento. You know it's fantastic wedding when the memento is roadkill. Hey! Maybe she saw it as a metaphor for the terrible marriage. So years later, she began folding the rabbits because she was reminded of how rotten it was. Or you know, something equally pretentious. Cool story, Neil. Are you for real? Just more dead rabbits. Poor thing. What's with all the road kills today? Don't you look at me like that. It smells like a farm. And road kill. Deactivate the scent simulator. Or get away from here already. Okay, I think this is a good place to wrap this up. So, thank you guys for watching. If you have any thoughts or game suggestions, please leave a comment below. Always love reading them, and I'll try to get the webcam working as soon as possible. But in regards to like some of the Telltale series I'm doing, I'm probably not going to have a webcam on them. And i got to figure out how I'm going to do a webcam on Here's a Storm or Hearthstone. Probably just going to replace like the hero image or something. But I'll figure that out in due time. And I will see you guys in the next episode.